Hello, so I am making a tutorial, my second guide, as you could say, on Untone servers. So this time I am telling you how to install Rocket Mod and edit your plugins and add plugins, of course. So Rocket Mod was shut down recently and it was handed over to Imperial Plugins, basically all of their plugins, like all of Rocket Plugins are on, on Imperial Plugins website now and you can install it there. So that's what we're going to do today. So let's go to Imperial Plugins website. All of this is there below, okay? St first off, um, on the first link you're going to see is the main homepage. You're going to click a Get Rocket Mod, it's going to bring you here, okay? Click Download Rocket Mod 4. It will download a zip file, it will be called Rocket Down Turned. So this here is basically the main module you need for rocket mod to actually work and it will install on your surface so i'm going to just copy that go to my unturned 3d server thing and go to modules i'm going to paste this here in zip file and extract it and there we go let's delete the zip file so now when i run my server it would wait it will have rocket mod on it and any time today. There you go, Rocket Mod is successfully loaded. Once you see that blue lighting. Okay, the server has fully loaded now. So as you can see that you've got this green writing with all rocket commands. You can use all of these in game, at least most of them. So let's go to servers and LAN as usual. Let's go to my server and click join. So I will be able to use all the other commands like I, V, and Vanish and all that cool stuff, TP, Unbound, Bound, you know, all that very, very cool stuff. So let's test it. So I need to add myself in the console would be a good first thing. So let's add me, Charlie. Let's do V, V, and then let's do Fighter. Nothing caps because that's okay. And let's spell it right. Boom, fighter jet. Don't be sure of my skills yet again in the video. But I'm going to crash purposely because I'm very bad. And I didn't even crash. So as you can tell it works and let's spawn in a weapon. Let's quickly do God. You know what? Give me a CPS quick. Um, you can also do teleport away point to get away from zombies. Boom. So let's test with a gun now. So I um maple. I gave me a maple. Oh my god. Well, there you go. As you can tell, it works. So the I command is a rocket mod. So now we're going to install a plugin. And before you think, no, you don't actually need to shut down your server to install the plugin. But you will need to shut it down to um, configure it. Okay, so I'm going to install U Essentials because it is a very useful plugin just for some extra commands anytime today. There, you can see the download will be around about here once it loads fully for me. There it is, download. So you can download that and it will download as an auto build. So I'm going to also copy that. This time I'm going to go to my server directory. Which will be around about here. And there's the rocket folder, plugins, and let's paste it in. Let's extract it to auto build and delete the zip. Not do this here. Okay, so we go to my console and let's do rocket reload. This basically reloads all of rocket and essential. It's in. Okay. So let's test a quick use and switch command. It should be rep. So let's do rep one that's how many zeros. Million Charlie FM that is that almost here. But I am now a power gun. So can I turn on cheats? Um, I can't do that. Right, so there you go. I am now got a lot of reputation. Let's do XP, that's not command experience. This isn't a use interest command, I'm just showing you how to do it. Again, one million. That's a lot more than one million. <sighs> there we go. And lots of experience as well. 
max skills is either rocket or your sound source, one of the other, you can do that. So now let's actually get a kit in your essentials. So this it has lots of kits. I'm going to edit the XP, plane and default. So let's test them out right now. Plane gives me a plane. Kit to XP gives me a hundred XP. And kit default push crack will give me an axe. So we have our kits and we're going to change them as you can see. So we're gonna change the default kit to give us a chainsaw and the XP kit to give us 1000 XP and also the plane kit is going to give us a base car. So let's shut our server down. As you can see we have been shut down. In our plugins let's remove this here auto build in fact, I'm just going to quickly sub it and put it in here. And let's delete that. So let's go to our kits and change them. Click yes. So let's change this here ID. This is our default kit to, I think it's 42. Let me just check on that. Oh, it's 490. There we go. Let's leave that there. So we're also going to leave everything else there. Let's go down to your plane kit. Let's change the name to car. And we're going to change the ID to 80. This is an orange race car. Let me check if my ID is right. Yes, it is. Oops, that was an accident. And let's set this here to true so when we respawn, we can actually get it again. And our XP kit. Let's set this to a thousand. And save. Now let's start up our server. Our almighty server. See what happens. And um, a quick tip again. Don't remove the auto build. So you see this here. Don't remove it. If you did remove it when I removed it. Just press control, control Z. And it will go back. I don't think you should remove it. I don't think that's right. Well it normally is supposed to be removed. But if it creates an error and it doesn't load your essentials, just add a bag then do rocket reload in the console. So let's clear inventory Charlie. Boom. Let's do kits. And we have kept car. Hell yeah. So here is my orange race car. Has nothing in it. Just a normal orange race car that doesn't even go that fast. And this here auto kit, so we have slash kit XP. Will that give me a function? Hell yeah, of course it will. And let's do kit default. Yes, give me my magic chainsaw. Let's inspect it. Oh, it doesn't let me inspect chainsaw. There we go. Time to cut trees. So that's basically all you need to know about your essentials and adding kits in it. So yeah, just to remind you, don't remove the auto auto build. It seems to me it's just creating that it keeps on deleting itself. So I don't know what that problem is. Um, yeah, so this is the second video in the series. The next video will probably be, let me think. Maybe using some Avi plugins or something like that. Um, actually, no, it's probably going to be more in Rocket Mod, so it will probably be with the. Um, let's think. Number, like, I'll probably do permissions next. I already have the permission, permissions video, but I'm going to do a better one. And then after that, I'll probably do the config so you can create your own, like, kind of like console thing. So that there won't be mainly for LAN servers, that will be for like out of LAN servers. So, you know what I mean by that? You know, if you're using a big server and like. It's not hosted as LAN, it's hosted publicly, so you can connect to the console from not the hosting PC. And then after that, I'd probably go into like some AVI plugins, which are a bit harder to set up. So, thank you. Make sure to drop a subscribe and like if it was actually helpful to you. Um, these do kind of take a bit of time to make. And also check out the Google um, folder, because it's got all of this knowledge on it. And it's definitely a lot more useful than me rambling on like this here. So thanks for watching. Bye.